Welcome back everybody, it is Run Streak Day 45, 5K a Day Streak Day 42. And we're running over to Waterworks Park, which is right across the street from Gray's Lake. I've shown Gray's Lake a couple times on the streak, so I might stop there, but that's not our goal. Our goal is Waterworks Park, just to check that park out. I don't, I don't think I've actually checked it out. This is the spot where we saw the turkey the other day though. It's like somebody's been driving here for whatever reason. I uh, had a little bit of a mishap. I um, I got stuck at like every stoplight or every crosswalk today on my way over here. And so when I'm constantly having to start and stop my watch, it increases the chance that I'm gonna misclick and accidentally save my run especially when you're wearing gloves. So guess what happened? About half a mile in, accidentally clicked, saved. So I don't even know if I'm gonna count that part of the run. I'm just gonna continue on and uh, probably just use this second bit. We'll see. I just saw, I couldn't tell if it was a groundhog or like a beaver or a nutria. There was some kind of large rodent just ran down to the water. He was goofing around in the snow, but I didn't see him fast enough to get him on camera. It's nice and sunny. It's about 33 degrees right now. It's really windy though. Right now I'm down in the trees and I've escaped the wind for the time being, but on the road over here, holy cow, it was too windy to film anything. Gray's Lake. I just stopped to shoot a quick cutscene, and as I was watching, big bald eagle just flew right over there towards the river. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. I'm starting to see them in town a little bit more. Maybe that's just because I'm paying more attention. They've probably always been here. All right, I'm gonna continue to run. I'm tempted to run around the lake. I'm only 1.7 or 1.8 miles into the run right now. Last time I ran out to Gray's Lake. It was three miles to get here, although I did take the longer route, but you can tell I lost that chunk where I auto or I accidentally saved earlier in the run. That's okay. I mean, even without that, today's run is still going to be five or six miles at least. Still a good run. But we're about to hook a right, go check out Waterworks Park. I think it's pretty small, and if it ends up being really small, I'm probably going to come back loop the lake and head home. So it's really windy, so I don't know how well this is gonna turn out, but looks like here at Waterworks Park, this road I'm running on goes all the way around these big, like ponds of water, basically. I had no idea this was over here. Okay, well, good news and bad news, I guess. The good news, is these pathways go all the way around these different little bodies of water. So, makes for amazing trails to run on. The bad news is, it's incredibly muddy and the mud is just caking the bottom of my shoes, just sticking to it. It's like this thick on there right now. I am not wearing my trail running shoes. I have my road shoes on. <laughs> so, I, uh, I'm turning around, I'm going back on the pavement part. I don't, uh, I don't wanna carry around two pounds of mud on the bottom of my feet and uh, yeah, it's just not gonna work. So, going back the other way, maybe I will end up running around the lake after all. I 
I got as much of the mud off of my shoes as I could, but there's still a lot on the bottom of my shoes right now, which is kind of making this uncomfortable to run in, but it's gonna fall off eventually here. Maybe after half a mile or so, it'll all be at least mostly off of there. But my shoes feel really heavy <laughs> at the moment. Nice park though, I will have to come back here with some better shoes that can hold up to the, the mud and the water. There's actually like a stage out there. They must do concerts or something here. Kind of like that Riverview Park, I guess. Pretty cool. I also saw a sign for something to do with Ragbri, which is that really famous bike ride that goes all the way across the state of Iowa. A lot of people travel to Iowa, even from other parts of the world, to do that ride. In fact, I was thinking about doing it next year. We'll see, it'd be pretty fun. Excuse me, sir. Sir, can you tell me how to get back to Gray's Lake Park? I'm lost here in Waterworks Park. I don't know how to get back. Which way do I go? Sir, excuse me. Hello? Let's go up on stage, why not? Why not? back at Gray's Lake. Nice run so far. The wind, luckily, I mean, it's been really windy today, but it's not that like super frigid, bone piercing wind. It's just kind of annoying wind, if that makes sense. So Waterworks Park, thoughts on Waterworks Park? Pretty cool, pretty cool. It was a good mix of both paved and unpaved trails to run on. Um, so I'll definitely be going back there. I feel like there was even a couple spots that I didn't get to, a couple of the paved trails that went around to another side of the park that I just missed. So it gives me something to look forward to next time, I guess. Here comes the tricky part, the bridge going over the Raccoon River. It's all snow and ice. Well, mostly ice at this point, a lot less snow. Pretty slippery, especially in these shoes. So I gotta watch my step quite a bit. It's not so bad over here in the snowy part. Okay, made it back home. Let's check the stats on the run here. So the first run where we accidentally stopped it was 0.56 miles. So little over half a mile there. We're wiping that one away. We're not counting that in the, uh, in the streak. I'm just gonna count the second part of the run, which was 6.36 miles, pace of eight minutes, 49 seconds per mile. So not a bad run today, pretty good. Enjoyed going to the park. Weather wasn't too bad. It was sunny for about half the run there. It's a lot windier on the way back. So I really didn't film too much on the way back from the, uh, the lake area over to the apartment here. It was more of the same that I had already shot anyway earlier in the day and plus the wind was just crazy. So, all right, that's gonna do it for this video. Hit the like button if you like this video and you wanna see the run streak continue. Hit the subscribe button if you're not yet subscribed and you wanna support this channel. Ring the notification bell if you wanna be notified whenever I drop a new video. Till tomorrow, everybody. Take care. <laughs>